Hey everybody, I'm here today to give you a basic explanation of air ride suspension. I'm going to tell you the basics of what air ride suspension is and how it works. It's actually a fairly simple system, but you don't really see it that often depending on where you live. So I'm going to really, really give you the basic summed up version of it in this video. So basically with a regular car, let's say you lower a car, you're going to have coilovers on that car. That's one option. So you're going to have coilovers and sometimes those coilovers are going to be adjustable to the point where you can raise them or lower them. And there's going to be a coilover on each strut of the car. There are four, going to be four corners of the car you know your front driver side your front passenger side your rear driver side your rear passenger side each of those is gonna have a coilover but for air ride suspension instead of a coilover you're gonna have an air strut and basically an air strut is same thing just a strut on each corner of the car but instead of having the coilover to give it its suspension capabilities you have an airbag so you have four airbags not like the kind for safety different kind of airbags but you're gonna have four air struts in the car one uh, basically attached to each wheel one on each corner of the car okay so that is how the actual um, air is set in each corner. And then you have to have a way to actually control that air, to manage that air, to inflate or deflate those air struts, those bags full of air, um, you know, close to the wheels. And to inflate or deflate them, you have a management system, which is basically, you have an air tank, you're also going to have a compressor or maybe multiple compressors depending on how efficient you want it to be and also a controller and then you're going to have you know the electrical like the ECU and then the lines to actually attach to each of the air struts and so forth so this is how it works you basically have a controller and that controller um, allows each air strut to inflate or deflate and on that controller you're likely gonna have some presets meaning like preset one two or three which you can set to whatever you'd like and also you're gonna have you know the ability to inflate or deflate the bags or individual bags or sets of bags so let's say you want to have the front of your car lower and the rear of your car higher you can deflate the front two air struts to lower the front of your car and inflate the rear two air struts to raise the back of your car so when you deflate an air strut or air struts you're lowering them when you inflate them you're raising them up and that's all done through the compressor and the air tank when you first connect your uh, your your um your air ride system what's going to happen is the compressor is going to fill up the air tank with air and that air tank actually holds air inside of it when you want to inflate um a bag with air you're gonna control it with the controller you're gonna inflate let's say the rear bags the rear air struts the air is gonna go from the tank to the rear air struts through the lines that are connected okay and then when the tank needs more air the compressor is gonna kick in and it's gonna fill up with air so the job of the compressor is to fill up the air tank the job of the air tank is to supply the air struts with air okay and you're gonna be supplying those air struts with air through the lines that are connected and also it's all controlled through the ECU and the controller and so forth and that's basically how air ride suspension works instead of coilovers or instead of you know different kinds of suspension you have air struts that control your suspension as you're driving and you can inflate them to raise the car up and give you more suspension capabilities or you can deflate them to lower the car and give you less suspension capabilities if you walk by a car and it's like dropped to the floor that's air ride suspension very simple because all that they're doing is dropping the airbags to as low as is required to get that body kit to touch the floor right so that's basically how they work that is the simplified version of air ride suspension if you like the video be sure to give it a thumbs up let me know what you think down below as a comment and of course be sure to subscribe for more great car and driving videos just like this one and that's all i have for you today thanks for watching